Same like you, Ben. Cheers. On Shane's few days home, I convinced him to come and taste test Jollibee with me. Jollibee, I see it. Went all the way to Jersey City for some Jollibee. I don't know what to expect. I am missing the Philippines so, so much, and I didn't actually try it while I was there. So we just drove an hour from home to go check out this Jollibee. Wait, I'm so excited. I'm getting like one of everything. You're too tall. Shane, they have sour cream and onion fries. <gasps> so cute. Hi. May I have? All right, I'm gonna get a lot of stuff to go. Nobody wants to see you, Lane. Shane's so shaky. We got the goods. They're playing music in there, so I it's think. Like, ah. So we're gonna go in the car to try taste test it all. And I'm literally getting hungry. Shane's not hungry, but I'm sure once he tries it, he'll like it. This isn't really gonna work, is it? What's up, guys? Can you hold this for a second? My mouth. Oh. Are you trying it before me? If you're new to my channel, I'm Lane Fable and this is Shane Fable, my little brother. And today we're taste testing Jollibee. Oh. Good? I didn't even really think that tasted like ube, but I knew you would love ube. We also love bubble tea, More so. I like the purple stuff. So let's go through what we got really quick. We got one hollow hollow, one six piece chicken joy. We did half spicy, half regular. One crunchy chicken sandwich, one Jollibee spaghetti, one palabok, I might be saying that wrong, one palabok fiesta, and one ube bubble cooler, or I forget what it's called already. Wait, taste the purple stuff. We're gonna go with the dessert first because one, I have a crazy sweet tooth and I think you should always eat dessert, and two, it's gonna melt in this freaking hot car. So, Shane already tried it, but. That's good. What is that, like I can't pin that taste. It's like. ube. No, but the purple one. Ube. Oh, I like it's it. a really purple. Oh, Shane, I thought ube was Shane the, likes ube. I thought ube was the stuff in it. Mm -mm. Oh, well, it's good. Shane approved. <gasps> Shane approved. Okay. Next is the hollow hollow. And I told Shane, and for all of my not Filipino viewers, this is a dessert that's really particular. Or what's the word? Native? native to the Philippines. This is a dessert really popular like in the Philippines. It's their iconic dessert. Yeah, they're like very well known for it. And it is mainly with ube, shaved ice. Um, you have like fruit and jellies, you have beans. I don't see beans in theirs, I see some. Maybe on the bottom. And then they also put flan on top, but holo holo actually means mix mix. So you wanna mix it up? So Blur. mix the ice cream and everything? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. This is so good. So this ube, while it doesn't taste like a lot like ube, it has that perfect underlying taste. Here, wait, if you wanna try, we should've got another one. Try this little purple stuff. It's like... See, that doesn't taste like real ube in the Philippines either though. I don't like fun. Or it doesn't taste like the ube I've had is what I should say. Okay, now go to the bottom, like try to get a little bit of everything. Here, let me mix it a little more. Wow, this spoon could be a little sturdier. I know, right? Here, you wanna try it like the real way with the beans? Sure. <laughs> Here, wait, I'll get up, I'll knock some of them off. I'm not hungry. <laughs> um. <laughs> TBT to old times, I used to feed Shane. Wait, oh. you gotta get in. A oh, cold. Oh yeah, it's shaved ice. I also can't chew on both sides of my mouth. Oh, that's true. He has a really bad toothache. Uh, mm. A little interesting with beans. Get your protein in with the dessert. Um, yeah. yeah. I knew he wasn't gonna particularly love it because we just have straight. Like I like beans, but not with my ice cream and shaved ice. All right, well, I like, this is a really, this is a good hollow hollow. That's fast food, you get it quickly. It was. I think it's delish. I also just love the colors and the little jelly bee cup. So is this Shane approved? Yeah, it's still Shane approved. But, still Shane approved. But it's not my go-to. Yeah, I kind of knew that he wouldn't be too fond of this. Now I know my dad, and I bet you Quinn would probably like this because you're getting protein while you're getting somewhat of a dessert. Now it is time for the full, what do you want to start with first? 
Um, let's try the sandwich because it's it's tiny and it's cute and it's wrapped, right? This is the Jolly Bee chicken sandwich. crispy chicken sandwich. No, the Jolly Bee crunchy chicken sandwich. It's kind of like a tiny let's sandwich. See if it's I like better than my crunchy chicken sandwich at Campion. I like that it's like a little baby. It's a tiny. Mm. That chicken is good. Was it just with mayo? Is there? Yeah. That's good. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh. Wow. That is that is Shane and Lane approved. Mm -hmm. I mean, Shane's the only one with the little sticker. Maybe I'll have to make my own. Oh my god. I didn't grab napkins. Oh. Jolly Bee is so amazing. They they remembered to give me napkins because they knew I'd be a mess. You're good with this? Jolly Bee's good. First, so far. Yeah, the first taste of Jolly Bee, of like real Jolly Bee, it's delicious. It's like a step up from that. So like it tastes pretty, it tastes similar, but it was just better quality. Better. Jolly Bee is higher quality than any fast food I've tried in the States. I also don't eat fast food often, but now I know if I do crave fast food, I should be coming to Jolly Bee. These were on like a little part of the menu. I actually forgot to order these. I ordered them second. They are sour cream and what was the other one? We'll open this for you so you can see them. Because this sour cream smells amazing and I actually love sour cream. And they gave us ketchup too. I don't know how, I've never really loved like cheese flavored, like some cheese flavored things I like. You love Cheez-Its. Yeah, but it's like hit or miss. These are the Jolly Bee sour cream and four cheese They smell fries. like the cheese Pringles, smell them first. Yeah, they do. Okay, I'm gonna try this one first. Oh my God, I could. I'm just gonna eat. The taste is good, but I don't like the like consistency of the fry. Yeah, they don't feel like they were too fresh. I like the fry itself. We may have gotten like an older batch of fries, but. Cause they're like a little mush, but the taste of the sour mm. cream and onion is good. Wow. All right, I'm gonna try a four cheese. Well, this is a cheesy one. They're good. I know people would like them, but I'm weird with cheese flavored things. Like I like cheese its Other cheese flavored things is kind of just like a miss for me. Yeah. I am in love with anything sour cream and onion, so. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I should move on to the next because I am I could just eat these all day. Oh my goodness. Lane should and we, Shane approved. Should we go chicken or like spaghetti? <laughs> Pala book, right? Well, I grabbed the first Pala box book. on top, so we'll see. So I is. love the boxes, honestly, even, this is like an unboxing video, even the boxes are like really cute, I think. So Let's Jolly see what Bee, we got. Deliciously satisfying. This is gonna fall out all over the car. Can you see? There's so much sun. I don't remember. She Rice said it was noodle. like noodles. Rice um, noodle with it looks like shrimp. Some egg, shrimp, and beef. Okay. And then there's like a almost like a breadcrumb on top. So let's get some. Oh, this looks sausage. good. Shane and I love any kind of noodles. So this guy's watching us eat food. Mm. The noodles like go down so easy. I feel like you could, you don't even have to chew them. They just like slurp down. I love the love the noodles. The meat. What kind of meat is it? I don't know. I I, I can't really tell what that is. I didn't even is recognize. Is it pork? The shrimps are so baby. Time for a shrimp. Pretty good. Mmm. Wow. I like the noodles. I think they should do it though where it's separate with either beef or shrimp. Because you get like different tastes, you know? But I think that like, it's, it's like, like it's meant to be like that. It. I know. You gotta come to the Philippines. I guess with I'm me. just Americanized. I'm gonna keep moving just so I can. This is our palate keep cleanser. Eating. Yeah, we're using the Ube cooler as a palate cleanser. So we have chicken or we'll stick on the noodle trend. Yeah. Bum ba bum. Okay, so I've heard that the like spaghetti is very, very popular. Is um, it or is? It is. Oh. And I know since we're Italian, like we eat spaghetti almost every Sunday or some type of pasta. Yeah, so I'm very interested to try the Jolly Bee spaghetti. It looks see like if I could go to a fast food place and get pasta like this, that's just yeah. great. Yeah, that's pretty that's great. Cool. Okay. This isn't working out. Oh, look at that twirl. That is perfect. Mm. 
I like it. It's a little sweet. The tomato sauce is a little sweet, but I think that's because I'm used to more salty food because America just tosses salt in everything. Yeah, it's not bad, but. I like it. Too sweet for me. Oh! Too sweet for me. I also have a sweet tooth, though. I was also starving before we filmed this and Shane ate because he didn't know he was coming and I asked him last minute. And then the guy this so I won't bring it in. What's the last one? Yeah. No way. We went too fast. And there are little pieces of, I want to say sausage in this. Sweet. Mmm. Making a mess. <laughs> so spaghetti is approved by me. I mean, I'm very partial to my Gma's spaghetti and her homemade sauce, but I do like the Jollibee spaghetti. It wasn't my favorite, but it wasn't bad. Jollibee. This next one's gonna be good though. We gotta make a rating system for our next one. Yeah. Like tenderness, crispiness, juiciness, and if you can't tell what it is yet, it's the bucket of chicken. Next, and what we saved for last, this is the Jollibee Bucket of chicken, not nah. chicken joy. Chicken well, and joy. I know why. Why am I saying it? Because I see that it says chicken and it says enjoy. That's just genius. It smells so good. Yeah. Oh my god! And look at that little face. Okay. I know we got three spicy and spicy on the bottom. Three regular. <gasps> this is the cutest thing. Okay. The way that they tell you that it's spicy is this little. Can you see? There's a flag. There's a little spicy flag. We're gonna try the regular first. I'm gonna first try it, a bite just of the chicken, and then I'm going to try the the gravy. All right, ready? Cheers. Ooh, ooh, this is gonna be a mess. I gotta get this mm. carton. Oh. oh my God. That's super juicy. Wow, that is insanely juicy. And it's real chicken, I'm so happy. And it's got some good crisp to it. Oh my gosh, the outside is perfectly crispy, and the inside is so juicy. Listen to that crunch. Now I'm going to try the Jollibee gravy with the chicken. I have heard many, many things about this gravy. I don't mess with gravy. You have to try it. I'm gravy free. No, you have to try it. No, I don't like gravy. Come on, do it for the video. It smells good. You're sipping it's, it? No. <laughs> it's very hot. You're so you guys have to let me know in the comments if you love the gravy, if you don't like the gravy, if you like the chicken without it, I would love to know. Where did my piece go? Mmm. Oh my gosh, I love the gravy. No. You don't like gravy? No? Why not? I'm not a gravy person, I don't know. Oh no, my chicken fell in the gravy. That ain't for me, but the chicken's very good. The gravy is so good. I don't like gravy. <laughs> spicy chicken. I think for the spicy chicken I'm gonna do without the gravy because I wanna taste how spicy it is. I hope it's spicy, I love spicy food. Oh yeah. Should I take a bite? Here's a little spicy yeah, yeah. flag. Spicy. That's good. Just gonna keep this spicy in my chicken. hair. I'm gonna have chicken all in my Cause hair. Cause I'm spicy. <laughs> oh my god. It creeps on you. Oh, I love it. Me mm. too. Might be my favorite thing thus far. It's my favorite. Heck yeah. Shane and Lane approved completely. Wow, I need my water, I think. That has a nice bite. I'll have the ube. This is perfect to calm down the spice from the spicy chicken. I also really like the spicy chicken though, because the dusting is only like on the skin. Yeah. So you, like if you need a break, you can eat like just the meat and you won't get like overwhelmed. Once you want to get some more spice, you just take another bite of skin and it's like right back in there. And the skin is delicious. Mm-hmm. Except I'm too full. Yeah, now I'm pretty full. I'm gonna take this out of my hair. Ew. Although, if they could put the spicy chicken in that crunchy chicken sandwich, that might be my favorite because I love having spicy, sandwiches. Spicy crunchy chicken sandwich, yeah. Jolly Bee, get on it. That'd be amazing. <laughs> All I have to say is wow. Look at that chicken white meat. I am kicking myself for not trying Jolly Bee. Or is it Jolly Bee? Jolly Bee? Jolly Bee. 
for not trying Jollibee while I was in the Philippines. I definitely missed out, but I'm so happy we have a few by home. So overall, I love Jollibee so much. Like I said, the spicy chicken and the chicken joy was my favorite. And then under that is the fries, the sour cream and onion fries and the four cheese fries. To me, they're delicious and you can snack on them. I'll probably be snacking on them the whole drive home. And then I have to say after that, I think the Jollibee Ube cooler. They also had a um, buco juice cooler, a buco cooler. Maybe I'll go back in and get one. What do you think? The pasta wasn't my favorite, but definitely delicious if you want to, you know, have spaghetti quickly. The noodles, something about the beef. I'm very particular with the meat I eat, but like I could eat those noodles with that sauce plain also. <coughs> that burnt means he liked it. My favorite was definitely the spicy chicken. I need to sip that to get in my throat. It grows on you. That spice is okay. no joke. My, f <laughs> my favorite was definitely <laughs> the spicy chicken. I feel like the spicy chicken and the chicken sandwich kind of like go hand in hand. Yeah, like the chicken and the chicken. chicken sandwich. But then after the chicken, I would say the ube was my favorite because it just goes really well together. And what about hollow hollow? Uh, uh, it was pretty good. Not my he favorite. He can't get over the beans, but yeah, I'm telling you like, when you I you're like in... beans, but with dessert is just a little different. It's so good though. Oh, especially and when you then, have it there. Like Lane said, I like the rice noodles a lot, but just like the meat that was in it was all right. It wasn't bad. Not it was bad. Just... It's just, I think, I mean, it's fast food also, so you have to take that into consideration. And then the fries had good flavor, but they're well on my list just because of like the actual fry itself because they were kind of- But looking past that, that's almost, that's number two on my list because the flavor was phenomenal. Yeah, the flavor was really good. We and just maybe happened to get a batch of fries that were- Spaghetti worked. was just not up to par for me. Only because we obviously were Italian. We grew up eating- Homemade all everything. All the bread, yeah, homemade spaghetti sauce, meatballs, everything, so. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Please let me know in the comments what you thought and what your favorite Jollibee food is. I hope to be back in the Philippines soon and try Jollibee on its home turf. So if you're new, please check out all of the Philippine vlogs. I was there for three weeks back in April, back in April, and I miss it so much. Like, comment, subscribe, you know? I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Update, we just got home. It was like an hour drive home. And we're eating all of the leftovers. <laughs> that spicy chicken. Masara. No one cares. Spicy chicken.